If you're an athletic person or an active person, somebody trying to stay in shape and you're not punching a heavy bag of some sort, you're doing it wrong. It's a great way for cardio to stay in shape, to stay active, and not bore yourself by running on a hamster wheel. I mean treadmill. But as you go along and as you progress, as your muscle fibers and your technique and your brain start to shift to what it's like to punch something, you start to punch through the bag. You see these standard heavy bags, you know, these 100-pound heavy bags. And this is even a nicer one. This is a ringside 100-pound heavy bag. It's raised up a little bit more so you get the bottom and weight so it won't shake around. But no matter what, if you hit the bag for long enough, you'll start to punch through a 100-pound bag. Then it actually starts to get detrimental to your workout because it, you've already capped. You're kind of exceeding it. And so you're going to have to look at something maybe a little bit bigger. And especially if you're an up and rising professional fighter, not just a, a gym rat. Somebody like my son here who's trained, this is what he wants to do. Even hitting like a 120, 130 pound tie bag that just has more weight, but it's distributed along an even platform that still shakes around. We're talking about a bag that's going to develop stone hands. That when you hit somebody, you might think you're not doing much, but in all reality, you're really kind of screwing them up just because your hands are heavy. You get heavy by hitting heavy things. So we're gonna upgrade his bag in his gym to a 200 pound heavy bag from ringside, stay tuned. This is the 200 pound heavy bag from ringside. It came filled up to 120 pounds with textile fabric, like a standard heavy bag that comes filled but it has a tube inside of it that allows you to adjust it all the way up to 200 pounds. From 120 to 200, it's pretty darn nice considering there are bags of similar price. Like this, it just to get a 200 pound unfilled bag, it's pretty expensive and then you have to fill it, which is terribly time consuming and then you gotta worry about running that you did it right. Check out that ring. This tube is empty. Can you see the tube in there? You can fill that tube with sand, and you can adjust it right on there, the sand to go. I have about a half a bag of this pool sand I got from, I think, Home Depot or Lowe's. So half a bag filled the tube up considerably, so I'm assuming just one bag of this would fill up the entire tube, and you'd have maybe a little bit of extra sand left over to get it all the way up to 200. For those of you who are wondering, this bag was about $400 out the door, but a $400 200-pound bag that comes filled, I think it's priceless. The amount of money you'd have to spend in clothes alone from like, say somewhere like Goodwill, and then to have to cut that up, it's one of those things where you likely have more money than time. This is just a super big time saver. I got it, we hooked up the whole thing in about a half an hour, and it took us that long because we sat and took time to film it. So off with, the cheap little Everest 100 pound bag. It was nice for what it was. We got it from Big Five. These things are a dime a dozen. Everybody has one. And we've got our good use out of it, but maybe it's better as like a throwing dummy or maybe I'll put it in my daughter's room or something. But this one's going in the main gym. By the way, we have a cage here that we made from scratch, a homemade boxing slash MMA gym that fits inside a bedroom. If you want to see that, the link's in the description and also in the iCard up above if you wanna see how we built this whole thing. But without further ado, let's test this thing out and see what it's about. Why, why you want to stop? Tell me, tell me about your experience on that bag versus the little hundred pound Everlast bag. Uh, well, the Everlast bag is, uh, it's... Uh, is it easier heavy. to hit or harder to hit? It's easier. This one's harder to hit. It's a lot harder? Like, why is it hard? Because they actually stuffed this thing. They actually tried this bag. But just like, is it, is it, what, I mean, when you're punching it, what's the difference? Uh, you just, you this, can't, you can't punch through the bag like you can the other one, huh? No, this is harder. And it only moves an inch. If I punch that thing, it moves like all the way across the wall. So. All right. So you think you'll you'll be able to get used to this after a while? Yeah, sure. Let I'll your hands heal. Uh huh. All right. Good. Hey! All right. My turn. All right. Test 
So, at the beginning of the video, you saw me hitting that 100 pound ringside bag. I was not in as good a shape as I am now. I was just getting back into shape. I'm still not in that great a shape here, but I'm still in better shape. So I'm putting a little bit more power and speed into this bag versus that other ringside bag in the beginning. And this one's barely moving. It's not even all the way filled up. It's at maybe 160, 170 pounds. You know, I still had quite a bit of room in that tube to fill up because I only had a half a, pa half a bag of that sand left. So if we fill this thing all the way up, I probably wouldn't barely move at all. But even then, with it just being at 160, 170, it's considerably better to punch. When you punch it, it wants to spring your hand back. It makes you work for it. You can't punch through this bag. It's much harder. You can lay into it, and it feels better. You get used to hitting a bag like this. You go back to a 100-pound bag, and you're wanting, you know, what you're doing with your life at that point in time. And this is what you want to do. If you want to have somebody develop considerably stronger hands, speed, power, mainly the power, you want a bag that will, like, pay that forward. You know, the, the punching bag is pretty useless. It can't punch you back. You can't, you can't do dodging drills. So the one thing it should help you do is get some stone hands. So get that stone hands and get this bag. See it.